Hello everybody, this is the Daydreamer with Daydreams and Nightmares and it is time for an unboxing. And to tell you the truth, I have no idea what's here. This is uh, from Loot Crate. They were having a uh, Loot Crate uh, sale and one of the things that they were offering up are mystery past crates at a discounted price. Um, I think I only paid like 13 bucks for this because it included shipping as well. So I have no idea what is in here. You're going to find out with me. Get that opened up right there. We open this thing up and we see Luke Cryo. Once again, I started getting Loot Crate uh, in August. It would be the first one I ever got. Uh, July, I ordered them. Uh, it was for the um, Anti-Hero. I picked up one for that. And I picked up one of the whores. So in all honesty, I know, don't know what was available prior to that. But it looks like we have a shirt on top here. Let's the side. Grab that out here. And this is what we got. I think this might be a loot gaming. Let's see, Gildan. Heavy cotton. Like I said I'm not 100% certain what I'm looking at here. Winter scene with a little planets and it almost reminds me of Galaga, kinda. Like I said, I think it's from Luke Gaming. I said I'll wear that. Put that aside here. Looks like we got a big box in here. That occupies most of what's in this box here. UNCS United States Space Compound Halo 5 So is this from one of their Halo boxes? Here we go Open that up Oh, and we got more inside here Looks like we got a pop on the inside here That's kind of cool It's a munitions box from Halo 5. Looks like we've got some socks in here from Star Wars BB-8 socks. That's cool. What else have we got in here? Got that in there kind of tight. Star Wars Loot Crate exclusive Han Solo in his snow gear. That's cool. Han Solo, Princess Leia, Admiral Akbar, Needum, Disney number 86. Han Solo. Always happy to get a pop from the original Star Wars. out of here. Let's see if I can show him off. Well, like I said, I think I paid $13, $13.50 with shipping. So, to get a basically a, what, an exclusive pop almost pays for the box itself. Plus, I have the socks and shirt so far. So, I think we're doing good. that down over here. Oh, he's even got a phaser. Here we go. Han Solo in his snow gear. That's pretty cool. Side. 
<laughs> and there's even more inside this little tin here. This this ammunition box from Halo 5. Uh, just down here and more. Now we are empty. But actually that's a nice little storage box as well. Yeah, that's not too bad. Halo 5. I'll have to figure out which month this is for that I got. I'll have to put that in the uh, comments in the description down below. I do believe the crate sale is over with, but we have a pin, Loot Crate Galaxy. Maybe that's what the uh, theme for the month is right here. I have a pin, or a button I should say, right like that gold embossed looks like galaxy December of 2015 that's quite a while ago that is a past crate and that makes sense if it's from December of last year almost a year ago that we have the snow theme on the uh, t-shirt here we also have a Galaxy Quest emblem patch right here. This is made by Quantum Mechanics. Also looks to be a Loot Crate exclusive. That is cool. Oh, what else have we got hiding in the box here? Oh, we can look at the inside here. Loot Cryo bottom of the box. Don't know if this is another one of those that turns inside out and turns into something, but maybe the book will say that. We have Xbox One Supply Rec Pack Game Item Download from Xbox Store. Right here, that was in the box. Code on the back here. How about this? First person that wants to use it is welcome to do so. I don't have an Xbox One, so if you're looking for a supply rec pack, and if it's still valid, I have no idea. Um, there's the code right there if you want to use that and see if that still works. For Halo 5. And this is Halo 5, a chat with exclusive Chris Lee, an interview with Drew Wise, 2015 Loot Crates End Year Review, December of 2015, Galaxy seems to have been the theme. A trip across the galaxy, Loot Crates Year in Review, 2015, said so this is almost a year ago. They did Rewind, Play, Convert, Fantasy, Unite, Cyber, Heroes, Summon, Villains, Time, Combat, Discovery, and Galaxy. Of course, we also have folks here that are looters show off their favorites from 2015. I know they liked uh, social media and putting up pictures of folks that are getting ooh the mega crate for this one was uh, looks like a gaming system here and a Luke Skywalker X1 fighter statue there that would have been cool a mini mega crate with a cord and plug combo set. Anyway, here we are. Exclusive Star Wars Han Solo vinyl bobblehead, which we have. Like I said, we show it off here. We'll review what we got here. Like I said, this is a, a between the, the, the socks, the shirt, this here, 
I more than got my money out of this. It's uh, like I said, I paid like thirteen fifty with it on sale, and they had the sales like twenty five percent off, and it was already marked down at that point too. So with the Han Solo bobblehead, that was their um, exclusive ugly holiday sweater T-shirt. That's what that was. Okay, got my own uh, ugly Halloween sweater shirt, huh? Exclusive Galaxy Authentic Prop Replica Patch, which was this here, from Galaxy Quest. The Star Wars BB-8 Crew Socks, which we have here. Looks like almost everything in here is an exclusive item, which is wonderful as well. Uh, the patch, by the way, if I didn't mention it, was made by Quantum Mechanics. Then you have the exclusive Halo 5 Ammo Tin Box. It's a great little item there for storage of different things here. Kind of like that. And the Halo 5 Guardians Rec Pack, which I said you're welcome to use that code. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this. Uh, this was a blast from the past, a retro uh, unboxing new for me it was a mystery box part of their crate sale uh, I like the uh, the Bible had the best there um, oh and I forgot the uh, they included also the uh, the button that was in that as well um, but yeah well worth the money uh, for what they were uh, giving up uh, with the sale and actually they also had as part of the sale they had uh, uh, curated uh, mystery boxes, not past crates, but they have all kinds of stuff on their shelves or cleaning out for the holidays and threw all kinds of different things from different boxes into a mystery box, which they originally had valued at um, 40 bucks. They marked that down by half and then with a the crate sale that was down to $15. So if it, that's going to be any indication of what I have here, those should also be pretty good. I ordered two of those. Um, and I ordered also, I'm trying to catch up on my Firefly, missed out on two of those boxes. I got one of those coming and I will hopefully be opening those up. Once again, this is an unboxing retro style going back all the way to December of 2015. Um, if you enjoyed this unboxing, uh, click like down below and please subscribe. And uh, thank you for watching.